Hey, welcome back to the stream. Were you about we to are gonna, it it was again. almost not working, but it's working now. It just took like half a second. But yeah, chat, welcome back to the stream. We have a uh, Paper Mario today. We're probably going to finish it. So, hooray. Hoorah. Let's continue. Let's just get this started immediately. Not waste your 20 seconds of I time. Would turn us up a little bit or turn yourself or turn the game down a little bit. Mario, I think, is louder than all our voices. All right, I'll turn you guys up. I can fix that. <sighs> no, Greg, please, 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 please. Bonk. All right. I bonked him. All right. Well, congratulations. He has been bonked. Yep. This is the same thing. Yeah, but one of them probably does more damage while costing more points. It's all about cost analysis. These guys aren't much help to begin with anyway. But math! Really? Yes. He's an asshole. Well, um, it was nice knowing you, friend. Not really, but also. Bingo! Oh. Actually, you know, here's a question. What happens if you just mash it? Do, like, where it does just it end up? Whatever. Well, yeah, I know that. But, like, does it go down at least one? Or can you just mash it fast enough that it doesn't change? I don't know. It's a room. Hey, it's like the Mr. Beast challenge. I mean, this is also just like a Mario game in general. I got the key. Mr. Beast is Mario game. Oh god. Like there was, there's the game in I Ooh. think five or six where it's just from memory to path and you'll uh, fall if you don't. Well, I got a green mushroom instead. Alright, press the button. We're going down! Yeah, why do... Why do we like elevators so much? Because oh. they're lower effort than stairs? Yep. Right, but why didn't we just invent, like, cars that drive up and down? Because it's more fun to have a train that drives up and downwards, which is to say an elevator. Trains are superior well, to actually, cars. No, no, what we should have done was we should have designed, uh, uh, what is it? Spiders, or like spider vehicles. People don't like spiders, which makes me sad because spider vehicles generally seem like a good idea. I mean, oh, well, maybe if you hit them into each other, it'll do a lot of damage. No, it's the lightning that worries me. All right. Well, now you're not going to be worried anymore. Or you could just lightning them back, since you're probably going to get a lightning, too. No, their lightning's gone. Oh. Wait, you don't get it? Uh... I think I do. Well, then let's then use the lightning. What the frick do you mean it's gone? Rip, rip, rip. And now everybody's dead. Congratulations. Hurrah! Excuse me. Hey, I did get it. Thank you, Daniel. Nice, I lost literally nothing. What's the password? Fuck! <laughs> Good password. There is no password. That would be really funny if they, if people tried inputting something and then it just was nothing. 
Well, that's like the dude who literally made his license plate null. And it, like, he wound up getting a parking ticket every time no one bothered to enter the license plate for a ticket. Because apparently the California DMV literally, like, didn't know what to do. Like, their computer system gave up. So they marked everything as null if you got nothing. Well, yeah, but... <laughs> eh. I do have to wonder how many parking tickets that person got. Though. He got $62,000 in parking, in tickets. Just tickets in general. Well, yeah, but just how many did he get at the end, by the end of it all? A lot. Right. He got so much that they asked him to please, if he would please change his license plate because it was annoying. Because he had to sue them to stop ticketing him for everything. That sounds like a self-inflicted problem. At that it point. is a completely self-inflicted problem. The guy's an idiot. So uh, business as usual. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds all right. Yay. Mm. Rip. There he goes. And we have obtained money. And a shooting star. Well, we should probably replace the thunder with it, unless we got anything else we want to get rid of. Let's replace the thunder. <clears throat> I'm still convinced by the end of this door will be at least one boss that we can kill simply by dropping as many thunders onto it as possible. One of these days. I'll come back to that later. This is a hidden secret that'll come er, come in handy later. Also, shouldn't one of these be Peach's room? Oh. oh. But it's still alive! Oh, well, that's okay. Somehow he's alive too. Well, oh, he's frozen too. Well, now he has different problems. Uh, Alright, nice guard. Why didn't Bobber gain HP? He didn't. He didn't get hurt. Didn't you say that he had that, uh, thing for, uh, uh, recovering one HP at the end of every fight or something like that? Oops, fuck. That toss was complete ass. I really don't think there's an easy way of doing it with poverty, but oh. case in point. What? I... Oh, is this thing activating? More attack. Oh power. boy, you got plus three damage. A lot of use, lot of use out of that one. At this point, you really ought to just. Uh... Well, I guess those are all explode. I suppose she'd stop doing that. No. I'm gonna switch. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna switch. Or not. Uh, okay. That's I a that that's works, a fight. But... Sure. At least it didn't last any longer than it already did. Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna use it. Good idea. <laughs> that guy was gonna throw something at you. And he has failed. Well, he's not dead yet. And given that those enemies in the back are very annoying, I'm not sure if you want to really let them live. 
I missed up the multi bounce, goddammit. Well, it didn't matter at the end of the day, now did it? Nope. Nothing matters. Sorry, going that way. Well, I didn't hit him. Hole. Nothing matters, everything energies. Don't think too hard about it. I think I want to change my ally here. Yeah, that's of... probably a good idea. Are you sure that... Oh. Wait, are you even targeting the right thing? No, I guess not. Hmm. Alright. Ew! This thing is really determined to live. It's the shield. The shield is not very... Helpful. The thing is 1 HP, the little guy, by the way. Well, yeah. I would imagine that the shield isn't that strong. Honestly, though, it's more a fact that the shield doesn't break immediately, and it can just keep bringing it back. That's the annoying part. Yeah. Because if it was anything else, I don't think it would be that problematic. Or if done in a different way, it wouldn't be that problematic. Which of course means that it has to be in the worst way possible. There we go, finally. You did it! Well, I'm telling you for an upgrade. I'll probably go for the flower, I think. If it works, it works. Into the next room. And yeah, what's in this one? That was a repeat change. Well, didn't you reread some of the stuff all around just to make sure we're not missing anything? Because I saw like a thing that you could let me Let's see here. Wow, it's almost like that was important. It's almost like I can hit the screenshot button too. Yeah, but if I hadn't told you to go back, you wouldn't have known to do that. Yeah. I can only just imagine how this would have gone today. It's just like, you know, we're just like, where's the, where's the thing we need to do to progress? And it's like, it was right here the whole time. God, imagine, though. How did only that one die? I'm also uh... out of shit. I'm gonna go back to the beginning in a minute. Or maybe uh, we could use some of those uh, thingamabobs. I know, I have an idea. Okay. Well, I, I'll start... I'll uh, start the sequence of being incredibly worried. I shall complete the sequence of being incredibly worried. Sequence complete. Ah! Go forth. Well, it's dead. You. I'm definitely getting an upgrade now. I Which mean... means I don't need to go anywhere to get an upgrade. Um. Much. Yeah, that did a lot of damage. I'm swapping him out. It, did you not ever upgrade Firefly? I did. It said I had no one to upgrade. Because Firefly seems really weak for somebody that's supposed to be upgraded. They're not, they're not saying that it's your fault that this didn't work or whatever, but I just feel like you should be doing more damage with the character this late in the game. Well, I think this one's invincible. Mm -hmm. To me, like that enemy. You say so. This is bad. Don't worry, it's just I'm sitting on you. I'll be fine. Just look the other way and we'll be all over soon. Hmm. 
Daniel if he was a train robber in the like 1830s. Not sure where that came from, though, all right. Don't look, it'll be over soon. Just like with the guy with the mask holding the gun to your head being like, don't even bother watching me, it's all good. All right, that's a firepower, 100%. Oh, hey, you don't even need to go back. I know, that's what I said a minute ago. FP for the love of God. Hooray, you have obtained things. I can attack specially more. You mean you can whiff especially more? Excuse me. But invincibility! Well, I'm gonna go to those other rooms, actually. Why, you think uh, any of the other rooms got anything? Well, I have the code and stuff now, so... I mean, you're not wrong. I might as well do that. Was it here or was it up a level? It was up. It's a level one. And now it's time to pull out the code. I think it was the other side that had the code for him. I wonder if that one was the gear room, actually, that you just looked at. It is, yeah. So zero, one, four, something, something, two, I think. Zero one four zero two nine. Well, I got four of the numbers correct. That. Oh, that's interesting that they give you more space. Well, it's because it makes need. you think it's longer. Well, yeah, I know. That's just it's kind of. A fucking oh, it's a game show. Okay, well. well, are you ready for the quiz? Well, Matt, are you ready? Oof. Nice. You know, I'm more surprised that we didn't get more of these throughout the game. Like, you'd think that this is a... The type of thing that they would have uh, included more in the game, right? If nothing else, it doesn't seem terribly difficult to do. Yeah. I guess they were just worried about how much people were actually paying attention. Mm -hmm. What's hidden here? Me. Elevator key. That's what well, he just said. He just said it. Also, what even the fuck is the pretty lucky? I think it's a badge. Koops' girlfriend is Koopy Koo. I don't even no, it's Flavio. It's Flavio! I mean, I... I agree, but also, that one seems very... What, what's the word? Out there. I mean, it's a thing that you haven't thought about in a long while. Yes. But like Umba, all the lava, other lava bubble, buzzy beetle, and boo. How many feet do they have? Goombas like all have put together. Yeah. Well, Goombas, so Goombas have two. What's a buzzy beetle look like again? I would assume that those are like one of the ones with four. And yeah. Lava Bubbles and Booze have zero, so I would yeah. say six, but... Well, what are our choices? Well... Well, if Matt would press the button... Four feet! D-feet! Yes, D-feet! <laughs> they have D-feet! 
Uh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I love that it. one. I'm gonna go with this. Because I think Buzzy Beetles, don't they have like four? Well, I mean, it depends on whether or not we're trying to consider a Buzzy Beetle as an actual beetle, in which case it would have six, but... Hey, I got it. what do you know? <laughs> Somehow I was right. Question four. Where was the one, the only diamond star? Well, oh, that was the first one. Gold. That was the first one, yeah. right? Because the glitz one was gold. Cortez's, what was Cortez's? Was Cortez's it like was something? red, wasn't it? Yeah, it was red. Yeah, it was red. And pot, no, Poshley's was red. Poshley's was red. Cortez's was a different color, right? Yeah, I think it was Hooktail. Nice. Let's go. Oh, yeah, it's because it's the very first one. It's the first one, yeah. No, it's for, like, the very first power-up, too. Yeah. It's the thing that I'm remembering. It was the first champion of the game. It was script? the Toad. Yeah, so it's Mush. And it's Matthew. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, you're a prince now! Yay. You've been adopted! Do I you get, get a, a say in the matter? Do I get to alright, I don't have to pay taxes anymore, or do I pay taxes to myself? Yes. You have the money launder by paying taxes to yourself. <laughs> Isn't that just royalty? I mean you are royalty. Well, we did it, I think. I lose. I hate you. Take this, you bum. Very sore loser. I mean, it's a thwomp. I'm gonna say the thwomps are nice, though. I got the key. Bye bye. In what world are thwomps nice? The other ones have been nice. I've never seen one. <laughs> They're all assholes, even in Mario Party. <laughs> Well, it said the elevator key, so you should probably go down further first, and then we'll maybe get up some more stuff. Also, do these codes change per day? Because it did say uh, today's code is blank. No, it just means like in terms of like the world. Wait, how are we... Oh, no. Hooray! Down we go. Choose your destination. No. Three. Eight. Okay, sending you through the moon. Welcome to Doom. Just... The Doom soundtrack starts to play. Do, do, do. Let's find the, yeah, the, the big fucking gun down there. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, you just find literally the... Honestly, that would be great. I would love that. Wait, what the fuck? I think you missed by virtue of the Z-axis. That's garbage. Hey, vampirism! I would toss out a mushroom, or maybe, or maybe the like this one of the the FP things because we're not using those. And vampirism could be pretty nice. Run <laughs> or walk faster. Perker, I had an idea. There's a thing over there. Whatever your idea is, you should probably stop having those. Yeah, ideas aren't healthy. Especially around these parts. There's the Man, I... thing over there. 
Yes, and this pathway is going to take you there if you just be more patient. I thought I could make it with Yoshi. And here we see the folly of all streams of uh, Matthew M's face. Patience. Also, I'm pretty sure that the ledge is just high enough that you can't retreat back or over it with the Yoshi jump. Because I think they're assholes like that. Thanks, Intelligent Systems. I mean, if you want to prove me wrong, you could try doing it on the. What uh, the fuck? Oh, oh, that's me. That's bullshit. That is. Oh my god. <laughs> this is. This is great. It's horrible. I love this. There are two opinions in this chat right now. You're once playing the game. But yeah, I am very much of the opinion that Yoshi does, does not jump high enough for this to work. That's just my own stupidity. Well, so like, like we can do a no, so like we can do a test too. So take damage and then go off the side or go step on the platform and then try flutter jumping to Yoshi or with Yoshi back on to the platform. It also doesn't help that this is a very grid based system for a game where you can move in three dimensions. I thought that was me. I got a security key. Nice. Yes. But that was only spade, so we need more of them. No, it's big enough. No. Oh, oh that. Then I think you could probably could have made it in the last phase, but let's see. Oh no, yeah, you you would have had to wait anyway because you cannot make that until the very end. Yeah. Well, that sucks. That took so much damage. Well, maybe we should eat a mushroom. And now they're dead. Thank you. Go to hell. Probably need to go up to the other room and then go down to the security floor four as well. Let's go back up a level to that other room. Also, no, yeah, go back to four and then we need to go back to two to the left. Because that one had another room that we couldn't figure out how to walk on. Wait, this one's Peach's room, isn't it? Yes. Um, it's an X dot, isn't it? I believe so. I don't remember. I mean, yep. look, it would have been way too easy for it to be. Can't flee this fight. Oh no, we can't flee the singular enemy fight. Whatever will we do? <laughs> In the grave with you. That could have been uh, slightly more dramatic. Wait, I think I let me see. Really? That does nothing. Hmm. Is 
Is there anything back here? Is it up here or not? That's interesting. I thought there'd have been something. Well, why don't we check like some of the inside rooms? Or like maybe there's something in the locker. Oh, legit nothing. Well, let's keep going. <clears throat> Wait, no, isn't there more to the right? No, it's a locked door. Well then, what other rooms do we have? I think the only other one we have access to is Comes the level two. left. Yes, yeah, the one that's left on level two, but that means we're missing three card keys. Or, oh, never mind. We're yeah, missing two card keys. Back to two. Sonic 2 battle. No thanks. Hey, that was that's a good game. Don't know. Uh, not today. <laughs> but you see they're delisting Sonic Generations because the new one's coming out. What they are? Yeah, so the, because the new one's coming out, they're delisting Generations. For sake, why? Oh, they're like, you can get it now in the bundle of all the Sonic games. It's like, okay. Oh, no. <laughs> exactly. Wait, no, no. I think we do have to figure out what the strat there is. This... Like, clearly something... Well, I don't imagine it's blowing anything, but... Oh, I see what it is. No, it's the it's the thing on the wall there. That's the path. Oh, what the oh. Okay, so I need to get down here. Then was that three? Thanks. Up one, left. Too far, I think. Yeah. It's done. I didn't go that far. Game disagrees. I was oh going... no, you need to go one more. Really? I think so. It doesn't look like yeah, it on I the think... map. No, it's two spaces because the space in between the top is larger than the... Uh... Daniel, I'm going three spaces over. No, you need to go four spaces to the left, is what I'm saying. Because the one on the bottom, which is indi indicative of one, is smaller. And that's also why the the box is there, because otherwise you wouldn't be able to reach it. So it's hinting to you that that's, two, that's four instead of three, like the other ones. Um... Down one more, and then to the left, and then same, or same back. There we go. There we go. So then? I have no idea where to get the last card, though. Did you get a gear anywhere by any chance? Not yet, no. Oh, there's a button and there's a gear there. Um. Uh, where are you? <laughs> I 
Oh, you're fucking kidding me. <laughs> I mean, I guess that makes sense, but also, why don't you press... Oh, right. No, that just will take you back, I think. I really am no. curious if speedrunners figure out the glitch to get that to activate. Can you imagine? Like, the that speed would run? be something. That would be something you could just break into the door and then... Uh... There is a door glitch in there that's on the GameCube version that skips the side quest where you have to find the bomb general. But they did uh... patch it. They did patch it. Uh, that's interesting. Anyway, can we, like, bash on the wall, maybe? Because I don't think we're gonna... That's not gonna work. Try a spin hammer. <laughs> hmm. Blowing. Can we reach it from the right side? I don't imagine so. Wait, no. There's like a... There's a grate there. Can we maybe fall over? Or fall from a higher thing? No, like... So on the very top right... Above oh, yeah. the okay. machine. Okay. So we need to find a way to get above there. Up that one said, right. Yeah. That said, you got me on how to get over. Oh. That's dumb. It jumped. Well, Gosh. you weren't at full height. Now don't worry, that's what the Ultra Hammer is for. Ultraman Hammer, go! Ultraman Hammer! Nice. He has consumed! Swing your arms if you're just gonna butt if you're gonna butt slam somebody. That seems incredibly pointless. And he's a dumb. I mean, I gathered that. Much, but... Well, it's dead. Well, I mistimed it, but fuck it, I guess. Also, it doesn't that just increase their damage, not their HP? Yes. So then, why do you keep doing stronger attacks against them whenever they still had a decent amount of HP? Uh-huh. Well, you have obtained shield. Shrink stomp. Shrink an enemy and drop their attack power. You know, hold on a minute. Is that a, just a standard badge? Yeah, it's right there. I saw it. It's above a little bit. Yeah, I would I would recommend that potentially. Well, that's just me. Hey, that room doesn't exist. Well, I mean nothing says that the grate has to exist in a lower floor. It might be somewhere that we can jump into. We just need to determine that the grate exists, not necessarily where the grate is. Eight. There's one down. Yep. Ow. Oh, this thing again, apparently. You have obtained attack power! Yeah. Obtain the power! Done the power! Greg. Congratulations, power has been obtained. Unlimited power. Alright, Palpatine.
Somehow, Palpatine, Palpatine. Somehow, Palpatine, Palpatine, and I'm still salty about it. <laughs> Me too. Damn, I can't believe Palpatine. Palpatine Greg, are eight and nine movies. both Mike on movies, or is just nine and not my Mike on movie? Eight and nine are both Mike on. Okay, wanted to clarify. That's just the quiz. This floor has been. It's, it's, it's done. Seven, I actually like. I liked seven. Yeah, no, seven was pretty decent. Yeah. And then eight came along. Yeah. But so seven was, was not groundbreaking in any way, shape, or form, but it was, miles uh, it, than was a, it was a fun movie to watch. Yeah. Is it kind of like meh? Yeah, in hindsight, yeah, but like, I enjoyed it when it came out. The, like, opening night was fantastic. That was one of the best opening nights for a movie I've ever had. Because like, I went with my, like, college roommate at the time who was like a huge Lord of the Rings Star Wars fan. He was like, I don't know if we'll be able to go, man. I can't get a ticket. I'm like, dude, then I'm like, okay, you know. He's like, I, I, I can't reserve the ticket because I got class at this time of day. I'm like, okay. Oh, shit. And he just went going, okay, okay, okay. No, but I'm, no, but like, uh, like the day of, I'm like, hey, dude, you want to go to Star Wars? He's like, dude, I couldn't get a ticket. I'm like, yeah, well, I got two tickets, bro. You want to come with? He's like, absolutely. So I took him to the movies. And you were like, okay. And it was dope. It was great. Like, he was like, yes, finally. After we got out, he's like, yes, finally. A good Star Wars movie. <laughs> My roommate was great, dude. I love my roommate was fantastic. Like he and I got like along so on. He showed me Lord of the Rings. He made me binge that whole thing over a fucking weekend. It was exhausting. But now you know how to ride into that one place. Isengard. No, not Isengard. They're taking the hobbits to Isengard. No, no, no. The other place where they had all the people riding on horses. That was really um, not very helpful. <laughs> In a long scheme of things. Is it that place where that fight is in the second movie? I think so. The one that gets memed into the steam sails? Uh, oh fuck, I gotta switch. Sure. Oh wow, that's a lot of damage. It's like the Knights of Gondor or something? Is that it? Chat, I don't know. Greg, are you there? Do you know? Uh, yeah, Greg, where was- Oh no, Helm's Deep. Helm's Deep, Helm's Deep. Elves Deep in the last ride to Rongo Indiana. That, that's what it was, right? I have no idea what you guys are talking about because I completely zoned out. We're talking <laughs> about Lord of the Rings. Okay, fantastic. Then yes. Probably. Maybe. <laughs> you <laughs> have... Are you okay? Greg, Daniel and I were wondering where, like, the places in Lord of the Rings where we, like, they rode off to, but they were, like, actually, like, not very helpful. They rode off in had nearly the every place. The... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but especially so, like yeah. the place where the king had like his mind taken over or whatever. No, I think, that's right? not what I'm talking oh. about. Oh, that's from the third I'm... movie too. I'm talking about the one where they had the big army on the horses. That's really famous. They all like went in and charged, and then got their asses handed to them by the giant the, elephants. The the uh, like Is that uh, the final outside, battle outside of the. Uh, Outside of the Rohan place. Yeah, yeah. wrong of mini ad. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> Greg, we if Stephen Colbert you. were here, he would be like, what the fuck? I if am Stephen alive. Colbert was here, Stephen Colbert needs better things to do. Absolutely. You know what he's probably doing right now? Sleeping. It's fucking twelve forty in the morning. Not to be that person, but aren't you, like, reloading all the enemies every time you come back no. to this room? No. Then why did the enemies respawn? That one did. Well, yes, but multiple enemies have been respawning, haven't they? Uh, how do you I don't know. There. What's the color pink? 
Greg, did you Greg? really just ask that question? What a real oh, question. I'm not listening to what I'm asking. What did I ask? What you is the color? That that is that the color pink? No, I think you asked what is the color pink. Yeah. Uh. It's that dumb shirt every dude in the 2000s sort of be like, yeah, it's pink, who cares? Because it was the 2000s. Now people willingly just... Oh, so stupid. Different thing. No. Remember those shirts that were pink? It's like, yeah, I'm a man, I wear pink wood. Like, that was the shit from the 2000s. I had a neighbor who wore that shirt unironically. You know who you are. Die. That's not... <laughs> We can't, like, knock out any of the control panels, right? On the side. No. Is this stupid? I think we have to go to level 2. I mean... Yeah. Don't worry, Matt. We're right behind you. All the way behind you. Yep. <clears throat> so I would assume the grate is maybe further to the left rather than further to the right, given how grates usually work. Do you think it's not in here, but it's like over here? Well, I'm of the opinion that we can work our way from left to right to see where the grate is. Oh, yeah, look, there's a grate up there. Hooray. What do you know? <laughs> also, straight up we've been not... Yeah, about that. Okay, and then one more. You also, where are we going to switch off of Yoshi? Well, I had enemies that were working for me, so... Okay. That sound. He's free. He's free. Oh, free do what? Away. That's a good time. He gained 10 HP. He's free and he's drinking. He's expensive. Power smash. And he's like, and he's dead. He's a lot of things all at once. Yep. It's He's like everything cat. everywhere all at once. I'm getting a badge upgrade next, by the way. What's this one say? Participation is not voluntary. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if we're high enough to reach this one either. Hmm. Yeah, unless you can float over, I don't think you can make that jump. Man, your Yoshi jump is shorter than your regular jump. I'm of the opinion that means that the grate isn't here either, and might be yeah. in a different. Yeah, I think it's even more to the left. Whoa, damn! That man's got an arm insane. on him. He does. Man should be playing man should football. Have been a, yeah, man should have been a football player, not a scientist. POV, you've played CFB 25 for too many hours. This I'm actually game. reminded of, uh, of uh, Dragon Ball Z when... Uh, your father was a brilliant scientist! No, it was like, it, your father was a, a middle-ranked warrior, but he was an excellent scientist. Yeah, that's the one. Your father was a brilliant scientist is the meme. Well, Have yeah, you guys seen the one meme yeah, from a Marvel comic? It's like not the same, but it's similar. There's a tip like Spider-Man's like talking to a pterodactyl who's like invented a thing that could turn people into pterodactyls. Yes. And um, and the uh, and he's like, you could have cured cancer. Why didn't you do that? He's like, well, I want people to be pterodactyls. 
That's I, fair. I agree. Why can't we just turn people into pterodactyls? That seems uh, like a much better use of all of our time. Than he's like, I don't want to cure cancer. I want to turn people into pterodactyls. <laughs> like it's literally, that's literally what it here. I'm gonna put it in Discord. Look, I know the meme you're talking about, and I agree with it. It's just, why can't we just agree to all be pterodactyls? Because apparently humans are rubbish. And we are rubbish at admitting how rubbish we are. We should all be pterodactyls. Well, I'll be a pterodactyl in my heart. <laughs> Fuck. Why do we blow? Well, I mean, you said you were gonna go left, and then proceeded to not go left. I went left, it was the room where the sheep was. Yeah. Well, there was a middle room, wasn't there? So I think this is the room where the where we need to go. Er, wait, can we go into the the changing room? I think so. Then maybe we can make the jump from over here? Because there is a grate right above you, and if that... That's not quite what I meant. Because usually these things don't have tops, do they? No, but I can't push A to do that. Oh. Which sucks. Hmm. That would be mm. something here in one of these rooms for it. Hmm. Yeah, I can nab at the doggos activated. Oh no, not the doggos. Let's see, we can't throw Bobbery high enough. Coops, we would need to actually be close enough to use. Goombella's completely worthless. Well, actually, well, go to the room with the gear and see what Goombella says. Are they at the gear that we need? I think you passed it. What does she say here? Thanks, Gumella. Hmm. It's a shame you can't, like, angle yourself after that. No. Oh, wait a minute. Can you actually... Can you shoot Alex? Or can I only ride him? No, Yoshi cannot shoot eggs. This is not Super Smash Bros. Yet. Or Yoshi's Island. Hmm. Let's see. He's Googling it. This I mean, I mean, I'm of the opinion that this is correct still, but no, that's not it. Let's see. Give me the stupid gear. <sighs> see, I also grab.
Grabbing the elevator to go to the elevator with the red pants. Shower. Um, hold on. Yeah, here it is. Head inside the lab and defeat the enemies inside with the spring jump. And then you can jump into the vent. So whichever one has the three X things in the tubes we need to go into. I killed those guys. Which level is it on? It's, no, you can't have killed those ones because they're in the tubes in the back. It was the one with the scientists in it. one no daniel i don't know what the fuck you're talking about and i don't know what the fuck the map design is without being able to explore it myself well daniel here you go i'm at the elevator near the save point this is what the room looks like it doesn't tell me what floor it is oh, but i would hell? assume it's in the top two. Oh wait that's that in the Oh, that's where the, um, I have to go down. It is not that far down, because it, oh, this is before the part. Matt, I'm literally telling you, I don't know what level, but... What well, should say what that... level it is. Matt, you can shut up, because it does Send not... Send me the goddamn link, Daniel. It's fine. Because, my god. Give me that. But yes, for those of you who are wondering, it says head inside the lab and defeat the enemies inside. That's it. It is the crane game section. It would appear that it's probably in sub-level 2, though. But I'm not I'm sure. I'm at sub-level 2. Well then, figure out which room it is, because your room checking capabilities are very, very poor. This one. Hey, look at that! It's the first room we could have gone into. But yeah, there is the hanging grate. So, no. there we go. I would say spring jump. Or whichever one's the strongest against everybody. Or you could just kill it out, right? That sucked. But yes, anyway, do you see how unhelpful that particular section is? Yes, it is. Thanks, IGN. That's not IGN. Thanks, Game Echo. Now everything has a shield. Now time for more bombs! The bombs will trigger the it should trigger now. Nope. Well, each one has an individual hit, so that works out. Alright, you gotta knock it out before it recovers. Come on. There it goes. And I get an upgrade again. Badge, badge, badge. Badge. Any more badges? Badge, 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 badge. Why is he getting fast low ups? We lived! Give me that. I was ready to skip this. No. <laughs> what does that say? Is so it like an A-list star or something?
It would appear that nothing's happened. Is there no way to like skip ahead? No. That's so stupid. Fucking Nintendo. I said it was like an Ala Star, I have no idea what that means. Maybe it just means you got a reward. Oh, my crowd is to get bigger. Okay. So you just get on this, I guess. Yes. You have to. Who could have guessed it was that see easy? Uh, yeah, we need to go further than that. Yeah. Let's go back. But yeah, it was like three room, two or three rooms down, I think. Well, two was the one we were just in, so it's definitely three. Alright. Now start this. We're in the wrong room. Is this a tease for Super Mario Maker 3? Because that's the Super Mario Maker model, isn't it? For Mario? I don't know. I think it is. Oh god. This is a Koopa. Surprised by everything here happening. I would change. Um, that's an excellent question. Um, you might be trapped. <laughs> there, there might not be a cure. No, I'm good. Okay. Yeah. That was so fun. Fourth though. down. Yeah. So we were all wrong. Let's go. That's kind of fun, though. I like that. I think that was literally the Super Mario Maker model, though. Like, I don't think that was the GameCube model. I think that was just the Mario Maker model. I mean, that makes sense if that's the case. I mean, they have that asset, and it costs Nintendo nothing, so... I mean, that logic, they have every asset. They don't have GTA 6. Alright. Finally, we can go back Get this to damn the gear. Call. Yes. Was we that? have obtained the Gears of War. I'm saving. So, I think it was sub-level 1 on the left side. Okay. Do you remember the operations manual thing? A freight metal. Hooray! You got it wrong! Oh, 
Why are we playing a crane game? It's, yeah, something about that doesn't seem right. Oh, this is just a crane game. Wait, did we need to do this? Because those are just badges, aren't they? Oh my god, this really is a crane game. It, it sucks just as much as a regular crane game. Well, we got one. It still isn't the last card, though, right? I mean, well, we did no. There's another room I haven't gone into yet. Yes, then I suggest we go into that one. Stop worrying. Well, I guess the star piece is fine, but still. Makes Mario immune to status effects? I would suggest yeah. maybe putting that one on. If you can. Yeah, I would imagine it's kind of higher up. So it said pretty lucky. No, go and go back and reread the stamp the stance you just got. It was right there. Be talking my Greg. It's feeling fine. Top two. <laughs> I'm trying to I'm a top. It's literally the top one. I see that. Oh my god, yeah, of course four. What... I don't have enough power for that. Well, firstly, you had three and then grabbed a couple things. But secondly, I want you to read what it says. Yeah, I think that's kind of important, wouldn't you say? Yeah. So maybe switch some stuff around that you don't really use too much. I never used that. Well, you have three. You just need to get one rid of one more. Have we used multi bounce in a while? Yeah, I use that one repeatedly. I thought you used the other one that let you hit all of them. Is that not multi bounce? I didn't think it was multi bounce, but. I, I don't think it's going to tell you like that. What about, what about head rattle? Have you used head rattle in a while? No. I don't know. I can hear his head rattling from here. Shut up, Greg. That's just the hole that's in Matt's skull. Anyway, let's keep going. But yeah, being immune to all status effects seems kind of major. I advise not missing out on that if possible. But um, according to the guide from when I was reading it, you might be able to go into the locked into uh, Rodus's room and grab the key there. Okay. Or something. Yeah, but that would also require going into Grotus's room, and nobody wants to do that. Well, you're not wrong. Not even Grotus wants to be in Grotus's room. Hmm. 
Just one. You see, Daniel, it's multi guns. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I guess we need to go to four one and then go away. Four one does on the right is the quiz. No, well you're currently on sub floor one right now. Anyway, it says it's further down this way. Oh, there's the last card. Now go back to sub floor three, I think. Ah yes, great idea. Piss off the fish. Piss, piss off the man-eating fish. Hmm. Certainly is a lot more here than yeah. I was previously expected. I don't know if that was just us blundering around. Incredibly hard. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a lot of bashes that this uh, walkthrough has. They've all been. Well, I think they went they have... really farmed. Well, I mean, probably, but also I'm seeing three, six, uh, six space badges immediately, then a five space badge, three, four space badges, and a three space badge on page one alone. Great. Apparently there is a way to increase your inventory space. You have to do the first 50 floors of the pit of about 100 oh, grails. <laughs> uh, you can't start on. Oh, well, that sucks. <laughs> um, are they okay? I missed. I love this recommendation that the guide gives is that get Mario to at least 20 HP in flower points by level 25, as if somebody was just shoving all their points in or level up points in the badge power. I'm yeah. guessing they had to say this because th they were shoving all of their points into badge power for a playthrough. Yeah, this one just appears to be uh, navigation and stuff, so I'll leave it to you. 
Can you toss Bobbery over that? Yes. Thank God. There's definitely some farmers in there, what do we do? Yeah, no. I'm reading up on the guide a little bit. Good idea. Vibrating. I mean, I would imagine so. There's a lot of gears here. I'm only vibrating when I'm on the gear. Laughing at the dickishness of Nintendo? No, I'm just laughing at and something else. Might as well just heal Mario. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. But yeah, after we navigate all of this, it should be the boss fight, and then I think we need another stream. There's no way we're doing the last bit yeah. uh, in one stream. <laughs> uh... <laughs> no, wait, hold on. Can we not hit the switch with we can't, I, need to, I I guess, but I need to... According to the guide, it's like on the left it's somewhere. Over there. Oh yeah, there. So I think you need to use the uh, the flight 
Or you could use Yoshi. Oh, really? Yeah, I think you need to use the flight thing on the top. I need to stay up playing. Okay. That's annoying. We're almost there. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't realize this part was so long. I mean, to be fair, did any of us realize it was this long? No, I'm already 40% of the way to another upgrade. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Next one's definitely yeah. BHP. Hmm. I don't think the music is helping us either, because, like, it's a very short, repetitive track. Yeah. The music is trying, okay. Is it? <laughs> yes, yeah, just no. not very hard. Believe in you. Great. I believe in your ability to 2D platform. I've beaten lots of Mario games. I must defeat this one. At the end of the day, it all comes back down to 2D platform. It really fun. does. Uh, yeah. It's just these 2D Mario controls suck. They're so flighty. That's and because this is a 3D Mario game, except that those don't really exist. Mario it's Odyssey? a 3D Mario game. That's not a 2D Mario game, actually. It's like Honkai Star It's like 3D environment, but then it's actually 2D combat. And now we need to go all the way back. Oh. I swear, this is not well this <laughs> No. This just feels mean. Is there any uh, Iwata Asks interview about this game? Probably not, because it's 2004. I don't know. I don't know, that was a thing. Really? Iwata, like, legit, like, from most of his time, like, at the head of Nintendo would be like, Hey, devs, how'd you make this game? And, like, he would sit down for, like, real interviews. How'd you make this game? Why'd you make this game? Did you even make this like, game? Like, and even ask about, like, spoilery stuff or, like, stuff that you're like, oh, I didn't expect him to ask that because it's, you know, Nintendo. Like, all they want to ask stuff is, like, all actually, like, god tier stuff. It's really, it's really eye opening to, like, Nintendo's, like, opinions on game development at the time. Well, Not that they've changed very much, to be honest, though. But, like, yeah, I recommend it to anyone. Read the Iwata Ask stuff from, like, 10 years ago. That man's been. Has he been dead 10 years now? Holy shit. It's been a long time. Alexa, when did Satoru Iwata die? That's the wrong one. Alexa, when did Satoru Iwata die? Eight years. 2015? Nine years ago. Holy shit. That this is... man didn't really... He can't be... He can't have been gone that long. I know. What the fuck? So now is the time where we should probably save. But you think? As a spoiler to the thing, I would also recommend somebody that can jump. Or either just defend yourself too, that might also be helpful. I hit myself. <laughs> wait, hold on a minute, wait, 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 hold on. Can you reload the save really quick? Would that be Oh faster my than save doing... scum? Yeah, probably. <laughs> Chat, fuck this. Hey, this isn't really <laughs> save scumming if it if you're not really doing much that you haven't already done. 
I think Watch this legit is faster. Yeah, Watch it put me like somewhere else in the room. No, I think that was legitimately faster. It was way faster. There's no legitimately about That's it. That's so you funny. You would have been at like the first part of the uh, stairway or the This, this isn't parts. even save scumming. This is just rational saving. Oh my god, it's funny. Oh. Huh. I've been waiting for you. Oh man, I've been waiting. I hate waiting. Well then, that's your problem. You! I've been waiting, you say. What do you mean by that, you boar? Well, I'll tell you what it means. I use a crystal star to lure you here. So I can take all your crystal stars. How brilliant is that, huh? That's and you want to know the best part? Idea. Your peachy princess isn't here anymore. Peach isn't here. Where'd you take her, you early burler? another castle. Uh, I can tell you the plan. That's novice villain style. I won't be doing anything like that. Sorry, really, guys. So, ready for showtime? You guys are going to be the perfect workout for Magnus is One Grapple 2.0. Oh, that's a 2 on it. That's. Well, imagine if that's like the only change. It has a 2 and it has the it's same. It's got the same amount of health and shit. The build to change this thing is raw horsepower, kitties. I forgot to switch. Well, uh, that sucks. <laughs> Let's hope that uh, the bomb effect works on this. It doesn't. Junior varsity. Losers. The music's a banger. Can't play this fight. Wait, you can gulp him? Yeah. I'm gonna mini egg him. Eight, eight. That has um, no effect on him. Shit. Maybe we should really look into uh, buffing all the units on. We should check uh, between, again, yeah. Between streams. Ow. That was, in fact, a lot of damage. How about we, uh, Art Attack is block him out. Wait, do you wanna- no, mm, It's your Earth Tremor. Let the Art Attack his ass. Alright. Sargolin. Yeah. That deals Art's damage. Um... Um, Matt tries like to two deal damage. 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 I cannot gulp him. Huh. But I got this thing, apparently. So my next attack is going to be great. Oh, my defense got boosted. Well, that's helpful. It's very helpful. Yeah, maybe you should just have Yoshi switch himself out. Go. I don't think that Mini Yoshi's gonna do enough damage for this. No. Hmm. You took more damage from the fire than from Yoshi. <laughs> don't unleash some of the sweet special features in this bad boy. Oh man, it's gonna be so good. Missiles. I that looks like multiple enemies. You know what we do about multiple enemies? Fail. We use our items. What the hell is that? What is that? Oh lordy. <laughs> I switch him to flurry. I would focus on attacking with Mario first, then have Yoshi switch himself out. Because Mario seems to be doing more damage than anybody. All 
right. And now... Well, why don't we switch to Goombella so we can at least learn what... Pretty good HP, uh, yeah. Star power! Eat all the stars! No, 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 not that one. The other, the shooting star. Yeet! Alright. How much we got? Here? 70. Oh boy. Yeah, so using those Thunder Rages is gonna be good. Yeah. We'll see how much HP he's currently sitting on after. Shit. Well, I. No, don't use Thunder Rage now. I would say if you're gonna do anything, do Spring Jump or Vampirism if you're that worried about your HP. I think I'll do Vampirism. Nice. Well, time to see if Goombella does more damage. Go! No. There's nice. literally no damage. Like. Um, that's not good. Yeah, maybe we should uh, double heal Mario and or switch Goombella in front and double heal Mario. <laughs> I need to heal once. Oh. Well, that's helpful. Now Mario attacks! We didn't get an HP from that. Hmm. And that's a little more damage. Fuck. That would have been helpful. I have to use a sweet treat. Oh, he's gonna take more of them. Is the audience actually good? Oh, yeah, it is going down. It's going down, yeah. That's fine. Oh. He's dead. Are you going to help us? Thank you. What's electrified now? I don't think it's electrified anything. Nope. <laughs> For two damage. What now? Defense. Defense would be nice. Yep, defense. Yo! We take that. And I guarded. Alright, jumping. Oh. Hmm. That's not good. I. I think you. I can wait one more turn for that. Let me just spin jump him. Or suck, apparently. So it seems. Now we might want to use Sweet Treat and then Thunder Rage. Alright, 
not bad. No, oh, Thunder Rage, Thunder Rage. We should have at least one more of those. No, how what? My rope is robot is on the ropes, this is wrong. And then one more solid jump from Mario should do it, I think. Oh. Oh, tax one now, Miss Floyd. Nice. Hooray! If I just don't suck at this. Greg, are you still Why high? did you say anything? Uh, maybe. I think it's li yeah, literally 3 HP. Okay. How would I know if I'm alive? Oh, you're still like. Oh. 1 HP! One. Hey, 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 hey. There's yeah. the thing, though. You can take one hit. Or he could just do that, so just multi bounce or just bounce on him. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Look, I didn't even jump correctly. Good Lock. job. This Earth is the power two. of finger. Nice. Money! We don't need you! <laughs> I do need those. We need a lot more of those than we got. And there he goes. Um. Okay, bye. Well, now what? <laughs> I got Crystal Star. Hooray, we got the actual crystal star, finally. You got a crystal star! By the way, oh, I learned soon over. By the way, you know what I'm picturing in my head right now for the you got a crystal star? You got a star from Paper Mario. Yeah. That sound effect. Erica Peach B. Surely she couldn't be over there. Bow's time. Alright, now while you do that, I'm going to the bathroom. Right here now is the stupid posh saying from Crystal Stars there, right? So you say your putridness. Oh lo and behold, there it is right now, right behind you. Great, about time something worked out for old Bowser. Here we go. All right, in we go. You're green evil king, are you really? Maybe you get a little too much sun, eh? My heart the fountain, so elegant. Your art is already the spines. I really use it as a... Whoa. Oh, who are you talking about? You people scare me, seriously. Oh, you're big, mister. What's your name? It's locked. You could have just done that. Does it even fit in those doors? Effort. I guess so. F for effort. This is finally it. You got a star! Last, I've got my mitts and a crystal star. Yes! 
Let's work, Lord Bowser. You're the absolute best star getting guy. You there. I mean, now villains, you are coming thieves, aren't you? Aren't you? I was never deceived. What are you implying? I'm not a little thief. I'm just king of evil. Let's take what I want. I want this. That was what you say. Rumor versus king of. What was that last bit again? Yes, I'm mm, Yes, yes. I so to do. So him. Then listen well. It's actually a variable red herring. Yes, an imposter. What? A fake? I fancy display pistol and everything. It's so posh. It's fake. The most real one, huh? I ate it. I gave the real one to Luigi. Hey, Kevin, you mean to tell me that Luigi beat me here? Alright, those are my heroes, most annoying brothers of all time. That bothers me. The fact we keep being up maneuvered is disturbing. And the world can Mario and his brother be heading? Where? So, important thing. Since we keep calling them the Mario Brothers, that means that their last name is Mario. So there's they have Mario Mario and Luigi Mario. Yeah, that's from the live action movie. Yeah. So it's canon. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just realizing that this means that basically the live action movie is canon. I'm going there too immediately. Peach and the treasure will be mine. Leaving now. Other than Luigi, we did not fail yet. Wherever you are, you may continue to triumph. <laughs> may you continue to triumph. I love that yet. I know. Everyone has full HP again. Nice. I have full everything. Perfect. Where was that little transporter room, Greg? Do you know where that was? Oh, uh, you think I know my way around places? You've met me. I can go to TC. I'm just gonna find someone to save. I'm gonna wait for Daniel to come back. Alright, I'm gonna wait for Daniel to come back. Stupid. I'm trying to explain on my phone because I had a thing and I don't know where the fuck it is anymore. I'm just gonna delete that file. I did. Okay. I filled with that file. Give me animal some animal facts. Animal facts. If you can muster. Uh, or give me some porgy facts, either or. Let's see. Porgies are adorable. Yes. Porgies can be fluffy. Yes. 
However, the fluffy or long-haired corgi is considered to be against the breed standard because it yeah. it's a recessive trait, and if you try to to select for that, then you lower genetic diversity and increase risk of inbreeding. Mm. Which is why they don't breed specifically fluffy corgis. You just learned something, maybe. Yay. Don't know how useful that is. Oh, nice. Apparently someone hacked Linus Tech Tips' is, uh... They hacked his Twitter. Oh. Fantastic. Fact, armadillos can hold their breath for seven minutes. This is very useful if they have to, say, do an underwater crossing, like of a stream or something. Mm. However, they can also swallow a bunch of air, flate, inflate their intestines, and float across the surface. Wait, what? What animal? Armadillos. Really? Yep. Oh, sure. How? By not belching. Tigers are among the most vengeful animals on the planet, but they have nothing on humans. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Hello. The only, the only country on Earth without mosquitoes is Iceland. Nice. Wait, really? They're in our Antarctica? That's not a country. It's not a country. Antarctica as a continent is considered under multiple treaties to not belong to any country. Hmm. Anyway, what are we waiting for? You. Uh, Literally yeah, you. Yeah, I have to wait. Kinda did, we're bad at this. No, there's <laughs> stuff coming up that's like relevant. Hmm. We are nowhere. And I may have shared this one before, but a, a sloth's turd can be up to a third of its body weight. You are Mario, are you not? Okay, you can stop the animal facts now. It, <laughs> it's pleasant to meet you. I am the main computer of this fortress, I am TEC. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Peach. I am sorry. Once my data was erased, my main power unit was shut down. Running a backup power with only cash memory, trying to stay operational. Mario, you know Peach is not here, do you not? Please save Peach, please. Please. Princess Peach is with Grotus, heading to the Palace of Shadow. I had to tell you that. Peach is in the Palace of Shadow? Okay, but where's the Palace of Shadow? No. Backup power failing. Mario, use the teleport room to get back to Rogue Port. The room is on sub-level 2 of the fortress, so I release the room lock. I swear there's barely enough power left to activate the tower border. I will cease all functions. Just send power to the teleporter for you. What will happen to you? When the power is all gone, I will. Cease to exist as an artificial consciousness. But if it will save Peach, I would gladly do this. Can tell I'm at Peach and you're nothing of love. Don't worry about me. I am just a computer. Just a machine. Mario, you oh, must see Peach. I ask you, please. Tell her.
This is what he's seeing as he's dying. So, thank you for me. Bruh. <laughs> I know. I don't think I should shove in a better romantic. We will attack. Or like a uh, romance subplot between Peach and a computer rather <laughs> than Mario. I know. I need to teleport again on sub level 2 now. Save her. No! Not the best character of this game! I'm gonna, now we're running an emergency backup power. And now we're all gonna die. See, now it's the part where we start running really, really fast. I also like to imagine that when this happens, the moon blows up. Hmm. Matt? What? You do remember what he said, right? Yeah, the elevator looked like it was not operational. You know, I was expecting this place to be blowing up a little bit harder than it currently is. It's not blowing up, it's just shutting down. Yeah, but it should be blowing up. The fact that it is not is... Disheartening. Deeply Where's agitating. my Earth shattering kaboom? Well, we're on the moon, so we'll get no Earth shattering effect. Where's my moon shattering kaboom then? <laughs> uh, this, is, this is a game that a, that a game aid is recommending. What? Um, it is a game called Tokyo Coffee Grinding in the Pandemic. What? Excuse? Yeah, apparently it's just a game about being a barista during the yeah. pandemic. Why did someone off? make that? Oh, and there goes everything. That's that sounds like hard mode. <laughs> yeah, that does. That sounds like pure hell. Is the moon blowing up now? <laughs> Goodbye. The moon is not blowing up. It is. Hey, there it goes. <laughs> it's hatching. There it goes. The moon cell is coming out. And we live. I see. But did you hear something a moment ago? Eh, surely it was nothing. But isn't Mario? I'm your son. You better go sail back with the moon with you, didn't you? Don't want to go to your Exonaut Fortress is on the moon. Ah, yes. Peach was there too, I assume? The princess was in another castle. I'm sure the Exonaut Ball Sucker made for the Thousand Year Door. Ah-ha! I'm spilled some rank air and went to the Thousand Year Door. It's a suspicious fellow in a cape passed through the other side of the door with Peach. Wait, hold on a minute. just bringing this up now, what you were just asking? What the frick? You lead me to believe that door was open to all seven crystal stars. I mean, I know, but I'm quite certain I saw it with my own eyes. A bad feeling about this very bad. Peach is in danger. Time is short. We must go to the Thousand Year Door and rescue the princess. I didn't meet you there. Don't dawdle. You must come immediately. Goddamn Deus Ex Machinas! Why didn't you stop them? Or at least take note of this and bring it up immediately when we showed up? Now, with that said, I would probably recommend we figure out where the near safe point is, save, and then. Or go to the door and maybe save there. I'm not sure. Where even are we, actually? Ground. Gee. Oh, nice. We can buy stuff. Well, there's no Thunder Rages here, though, which is. There's no Thundaga. Yeah, there's no Thundagas here, which is very disappointing. But I do need more HP mushrooms. You don't need them, they're just a good idea. But Thunder Guy! Oh shit, I'm buying some of this. 
Oh man, look at your money go down. Damn. And we were complaining about having too much money for most of this game. What happened? The correct use of money. This is how the economy works. Maybe get rid of the tasty tonic and golden leaf too. Here's poison. I can't. Well, you can't poison off my poisoned. allies at the moment. Well, you, my allies can. Your allies are weak as hell. <laughs> Honestly, I think we're fine as currently. What do those gold bars do, actually? It's helpful. What does it do? <laughs> no, seriously, what does the gold bar do? I don't know. Money? <sighs> Blunt instrument? I saw that deep down, or they can be so. Why leave this place? Oh! Okay, well, that makes sense. You know, they should have designed Rogue Port as a roguelike. That would be something. So. It oh, says know. that. This is basically a way to store money in the original game. Because oh. you would buy it at the limit and then basically keep it for safekeeping. Now that oh. you have more money space, you so can... So it's kind of useless in this game. Well, not necessarily. It says it's that you can useful. buy or sell them for 350 coins if you sell them on the train. Oh, so, oh, so it's an investment. Yeah, so theoretically speaking, if you go and farm this, you should be able to get infinitely recurring money. That is stupid. Well, as a reminder, you're getting 50 co or 20 coins each time, and at best you could have bought like three of them. So you would have gotten exactly 60 coins extra and then had to keep doing that over and over. This is not a very easy thing to do, but it is a thing you can do, technically. So where are we off to? We're gonna go to bed and save. We are off and... to see the wizard. The wonderful wizard of Oz. We hear he is a whiz of a whiz, if ever a whiz there was. If ever, oh, ever a whiz there oh, was. Oh, Luigi. The Wizard of Oz is one. Because, because. I scaled a hate song because, tower because, the other day and rescued the fair princess Eclair. As I mentioned, never forget. Nope, it was too exciting. It was astonishing, but I want to hear what happens. It's a long story. All right, last chance for because Luigi. All the wonderful things he does. I guess okay, it's a really long story, and that part is just wow. Here goes. It stands atop a jagged, unclimbable cliff beyond the northernmost sea. Wait, how does it climb down a cliff? Helling Lake Banshee's singing songs of hate. People say it's pretty much the scariest place in the world, and I had to go there. Looking out the bone chilling howls, I somehow managed to reach the tower's door. That's sure if I had thoughts of Vincent Claire warmed my heart and gave me power. All my companions felt the same way they were with me to the bitter end. Or the tower swung slowly open to reveal an inconceivable darkness. I tried to call out a Claire's name, but I couldn't even breathe because. The shimmers in the darkness are the most terrifying beast of all. The chestnut king himself appeared before me. He was monstrous and drooling. Lots of toxic goo dripped from his chest. mouth, melting the very ground at our feet. I couldn't stop shaking, but I gripped my teeth and faced the evil beast dead on. I dodged the king's fangs, jumped onto his chest, and gave him a hammer whack. 
Ice Thing split the air and crashed dead center onto the Chestnut King's skull. Up oh, powered me up, Rose, going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the King, and I was loving it. This is it. I thought I can win this. I'll risk it all my next blow. I remember a Titan wave for my moment. The tension stung me. Shwack! The ocean winds raged against the tower windows. That sound is my call to buy. Advanced no mercy in my heart. And then... And then... And then I woke up. I beat him. I defeated the Chestnut King. Whoa. Even worse peace came next, but nightmare thing, but I beat it too. Rescue's Princess of Claire was all over. I came back to work and had a light lunch, and that's about it. Hold on, I feel like we skipped a couple steps here. Huh? I think there's more to the story than that? Oh, that's it. That's the whole story of the quest for Princess of Claire, the end. We're just going here, bro. They'll know our end. Wow. This story sucks. Hey, you remember me? It's me, Bluey. Man, no, that's what I was here. You have no idea. I was burnt to Chris, but I was actually kind of relieved. You can believe that. If you want the whole story, you should ask Luigi here. <laughs> okay. I'd rather not, thanks. <laughs> Did you sleep well? No. Well, Luigi was here. <laughs> missed good job all right. all right well that chat that'll do it for us today i was not expecting that to actually be two hours so we're gonna have another stream left uh where we basically just hit the final boss in the face so come back your that. door doesn't end <laughs> no this game is uh it's honkai Starro basically it just gets updated again and again and again and again every <laughs> six weeks of content this game's I actually imagine. made by Toyoverse. I lied that it's from Nintendo. They got no, the license from Mario from Nintendo, but they were licensed to Toyoverse. Imagine thousand year door, but it gets updates every six, every six weeks or so for a thousand years. Oh god! <laughs> they just pass it off from developer to developer, and they're like, "Who created this game in the first place?" This, and everyone's like, "I don't this, know." This is the legacy of our civilization. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Humanity ends, but they still get you updates. Like, I swear to God, the world could end and we'd still get a fucking Genshin update in six weeks. <laughs> but yeah, no, that'll do it. What did you guys think of today, besides the kind of messy exploration and also, like, dumbassness? Uh, well, the dumbassness is business as usual, but the exploration is very much not quite intuitive. It, no. It's, it's, it's messy. It also doesn't help that there are rooms that are useful and rooms that are not. Yeah. Which I guess is the nature of the game, but... What do you do? You know? But, uh... Complain about it. Greg, what about you? It's, um... Uh... It's not so bad watching but I do not think that this would have been like this it does not feel like a very good game for kids with short attention spans by which I mean it does not feel like a good game for most humans in terms of attention span because there's a lot of traversing around things that look kind of samey, and you you have to be invested in the story to really bother. Which, I mean, props to them for making it good enough that you bother with it, but it's... Uh, like, the... It feels like the same problem that a lot of open world stuff has, where you, uh... You've seen the same scenery so many times getting from point A to point B, that it all just kinda starts to blend together. Yeah. And it feels like a time sink rather than exploring the world like it felt early on. <clears throat> yeah. And even when you're entering new environments, like on the moon, it just... The mechanics of it all feel samey, even if you're, like, solving pathfinding puzzles or figuring out a new environment. Yeah. Mm. But yeah, that will do it for us today with Paper Mario. 
So uh, come back on Tuesday for the continuation of Honkai Star Rail, Kabamon on Wednesdays, Pokemon Sun on Thursday, uh, Subspace Emissary shall continue on Saturday, and then this game, probably the actual finale finally, will be next week. Yay!